Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Project Zomboid. This is episode two. And we're in the trailer that we spent the night in last episode. So, probably just gonna move on and continue on the route we were going. Just gonna take a drink from this faucet really quickly. Check, make sure I didn't leave anything in the fridge. And we're off. Outside seems to be pretty clear. There's that zombie we killed. And alright, we're just gonna head on down this way. Oh, looks like there's a bunch of zombies. Just gonna try to avoid those. Getting stuck in the trees. And we haven't caught any of their attention so far. I don't like that music, but probably just panicked from seeing all the zombies. There's another one. Gonna keep moving. Keep heading this way. And what's this? Oh, it's the train tracks. I know these train tracks. They lead, if you follow them north, they go to a well. Which is good for later in the game, because as I said last episode, they turn the water off and you don't get to use the faucets anymore. So I'm going to head south. And hopefully we run into something interesting and this isn't just a long trip that ends up being a waste of time. Alright, if this ends up taking too long, I'm going to edit the video, and if I do that, I'm going to stop it right here. And we're back. I did edit the video because it was a long, arduous journey that led nowhere, and now we're just hungry, thirsty, tired, and panicked because I did have to kill one zombie while I was going down there. So now we're just going to run around and try to find somewhere to shack up for the night, continue on in the morning.
So we're going to continue going up. parking lot and some shops hopefully there's somewhere in these shops that I can sleep for the night might be kind of dangerous with the glass windows but I've slept in worse places just checking the windows I'm going to check around back. Alright. Then it's unlocked. Doesn't look like there's going to be anywhere on this side that I can sleep though. So I'll just check these back boxes real quick. Hopefully I can get something useful. Like an axe or a bat. And some nails. Those will be useful later. I'll take the watering can too, I guess. And it doesn't look like I can get into the other side from over here, so. Check this vending machine. And there's a tomato in the vending machine. Alright. And looks like this window's locked. Seeing if I could loot through the wall real quick. And this window appears to be locked as well, so probably going to beat down the door. But that'll attract that zombie over there. Will it attract that zombie over there? Yes, it did. I'm just gonna take this guy out. And that one's still not paying any attention to us, so... I'm gonna whack the door down the rest of the way. And we're in. Check in here, nothing. Check the desk. Pencil. And what's in here? Is this a bathroom? Yes, it's a bathroom. Is there anything in here? No, there's not. Alright. Just gonna sleep behind this desk, I guess. Can I? No, not gonna let me. 
Alright, I'll just sleep in this chair down here, I guess. Hopefully nothing gets us in the night. Hopefully we'll be okay in the morning. Pretty sure we will. Times like this, I wish I could just wake up. We seem alright though. I'm gonna eat. Well, I want to check, make sure the milk is okay before I eat it because it has been sitting out in our inventory for a couple of days now. But I'm seeing shoes instead of milk. So I'm just going to eat the milk. And we're all good. Perfectly fine. Day and a half in my inventory with no refrigeration. Oh well. Just drink the milk anyway. Perfectly fine. And take out these couple of zombies. Like I said, this takes forever. We need to get a bat or an axe or something. Even a shovel would do good. I like that noise. Whenever I hear it, I always want to look all around. That's too many to fight, so we're just going to carry on this way. And there's trailers. If I had just walked an extra 20 feet last night, I could have slept in a bed instead of a blue chair. But oh well. Quite a bit of zombies over there. Probably just gonna move on and. Well. Yeah, probably just gonna move on. See if we can't get somewhere a little better. But I would like to find a place and start making that our home. See what's up here. I don't know the map very well. Still trying to learn most of it. Looks like there's going to be a house here, though. Yep. Let's check the yard really quickly. It looks fine. You gonna let us in? Nope. Try the side. And we're in. Give it a second, see if there's an alarm. Because there were a lot of zombies down the ways a bit. 
Come on, let us in. Alright, there we go. Uh, let's look around quickly. Make sure we're safe here. And this looks like a decent place where uh, we know the direction to go in to get on the path to the well for later. Don't need it immediately, but we will need it later. Just going to sheet up the windows here and make this our base. Two of them down. Looks like there's only three more. Close this one. I always do that whenever I come through a window for some reason. I need to be better about closing them after myself. See if there's another window on the side of the house. I don't think so though, because this is probably a, yep it's a bathroom. There's usually not windows in the bathrooms. Sometimes, but rarely. There's a whole lot of goodies in there. I'm gonna go ahead and get my inventory straightened out and. Uh, See you guys next episode. Don't forget to comment, leave a rating. Thanks.